guys, how you doing today? Officer Wings here with another episode of GTA 4 LCPDFR uh, Michigan State Police Series. Today is going to be episode 4. We're going to do a morning shift. It's currently 5 a.m. We're going to go around and see if we can catch some speeders or anything else like that and see what kind of calls we can get into. Uh, I know it's only a small amount, but thank you to the five guys who have subscribed to my channel so far. Uh, hopefully maybe within a few months we can have up to 100 once we get to that point we will uh, do a little giveaway or something like that maybe a $20 card to somewhere uh, as well right now uh, today we're gonna be riding in this blue Michigan State Police Crown Victoria we also uh, just downloaded a cry EMB modification if you guys are interested in uh, this modification uh, I suggest using not AJ tutorial on this LCPDFR install. It's at the end. It takes about five minutes to install, but it makes the game look uh, a lot, a lot more better, I'd say. And uh, I have pretty low end PC, so it works for my computer. So uh, if it works for mine, it should uh, hopefully work for yours. But uh, anyway, we'll go ahead and get into it. And thank you for watching. All right, guys. Right now, this guy in front of us in this van, uh, he popped back for uh, involved in a hit and a run. So I'm only assuming that he hit a vehicle in an accident, drove off, didn't stop like he was supposed to. So we're going to go ahead and pull him over and then uh, go from there. Alrighty. We're gonna go ahead and approach him from the other side so we don't get hit by any other cars on uh on traffic right now in the street. We'll hit other we'll grab his ID from him and then we'll go ahead and go back to a patrol cruiser and uh check his ID on our computer and then see what he pops back with he'll usually tell us if he has a warrant for his arrest and if he does they'll probably be for the hit and run and of course he's one of these guys that has a really weird name that I just misspelled P O R F I R I O Feral. Alright, let's see what he comes back with. Alright, so this guy has one citation, valid license, stop twice, no active warrants. Um, right now, based on that information and what he pops back with, we're just going to hit him with a summons and a uh, $100 fine and then send him on his way and then you'll have to go in court some other time and you'll have to take care of it then and there. Gracias, have a good one. Yeah, but other than that, uh, he's all good to go. Uh, I guess we'll see him in court when that day comes, but go ahead and uh, search for the next person we're going to go ahead and stop alrighty guys this uh, person right here in this little uh, van just went through a red light so we're going to go ahead and pull him over and uh, see what we can find on him if they want to stop for us. <laughs> uh, they park in the worst spots. Alright, 
and she's running from us. deal with this right now. I was hoping for a pretty calm morning shift right here. This will be this last guy's chance right here before he gets tased. Alrighty. If this thing wants to hit him. There we go. Usually they stop after one uh one shot, but this guy just doesn't want to quit. Come on, man. Hey, you, halt. Place both of your hands up on your head, please. All right, we got him now. So usually what I do in a situation like this, I try to, I mean, pat them down, get their license and everything like that, but whatever the way LCPDFR is right now, it won't really let me do that anymore. It kind of just, the pets will kind of just go and uh, run off on me and just makes them more of a pain. So I usually just arrest them and have a unit come pick them up to take them to the station instead of dealing with that headache. Uh, but... That's going to be it for this one. This guy's going to jail. Uh, what he's charged with will pop up in the top right corner. And uh, we'll go hunt for our next one. We have the suspect in custody. Alright guys, we're going to be stopping this van right now for unpart er, unpaid citations. Uh, we'll pull them over, confirm the unpaid citations, and then we'll go from there. What up though? You want to find out how so many people fall down the stairs in my creek? Nah, B, that ain't it. Thank Looks like they got two passengers, so we'll go run their ID. Hopefully they don't come back with anything, so this can be a quick uh, ticket and then be sent on their way. And if not, then we'll have to deal with uh, getting them both in custody. Alright, so the driver. Really weird name. Gidget. R-E-U-B-E-N. R I V E R S. <sighs> oh, no matches found. Or what did we do wrong here? We'll try his name again. So R E U B E N R I V E R S. Um, okay, so this guy has two citations, a valid license, he was stopped three times, and, uh, 
Yeah, so he's no active born, so we're not going to take him in on unpaid tickets, but we're going to give him another one today in a summons, so we can go get that situated. Now, we'll look up his friend that he has there in the car real quick. Gidget Middleton. Alright, so she comes back for it's all good. One ticket. Valid license stopped two times, so everything comes back pretty much all good with this guy. We're just gonna let him go with a ticket and a citation today, or a ticket and a summons today, and get him on out of here. We'll just go ahead and give him a one hundred dollar one, and then just send him on his way. Alrighty, and that'll be that. Alright guys, we're going to pull over this motorcycle right now for not having a license plate. Uh, I switched up the vehicle so we get have some variation at night. Also remember too, uh, if you guys want to see any other different departments, uh, after our 20th episode we'll be switching cars and uniforms. So if you guys want to, if you guys have any suggestions, just leave it right in the comments and uh, I can get working on that once we get to that point. So. Alright, so what just happened back there is uh, when you get out of your car too early before you like set behind him, it just cancels it. So we'll just go ahead and pull him over somewhere else. Alrighty. Hey, be good, Julian. Did you see that chick? I woke up with silicon eel mops. Hey, hello, be good. You want to have a nasty accident? LCPD, show me your ID. You said it. Thanks. We'll just call this one in this time for this guy and see what he pops back with. Okay, he only has one ticket and one not. Uh, I'm just going to let him off with a $40 ticket today and a uh, fix it ticket so he can uh, get his license plate situation figured out. But that's going to be it for that one, and I guess uh, we'll go see if we can go uh, get ourselves into some calls or something now to give us something more to do tonight. Alright guys, uh, getting morning time here. Uh, we just got a call of a man with a knife going to respond to that. That'll probably be one of our last calls of the night uh, that we'll be responding to before we end our shift. But uh, we got this guy with the knife over here. We're gonna try and catch up and uh, see if we can't get it contained. Hopefully, it doesn't end badly. But uh, it usually almost always does. So I guess we'll see what it ends up being for this guy. And if we can even get through this traffic right here for how bad it is.
Alrighty guys, we're on sand, he's coming at us. No, this guy already screwed it up for himself. Alright, we'll try to tase him and get him. Yep. will probably be our last stop of the night tonight. Uh, I think we had a pretty good night with uh, the stops and the uh, people we have taken into custody. So we'll go ahead and call this guy in prisoner transport and uh, head on for uh, a little debrief for the night. Alright guys, that's going to be it for us tonight. I think we had a pretty successful night tonight. Uh, a few good stops, a few arrests and everything. Um, we're gonna go ahead and call it a night at that. It's getting light out now. I got, I got some reports to fill out and whatnot. Um, if you guys have any other departments or anything you want to see, like I've been saying, go ahead and leave it in the comments. We'll do 20 episodes of the Michigan State Police, and then we'll go do 20 episodes of another department and keep going on from there. And we'll eventually move our way to LSPDFR, or if by the time that happens, uh, maybe even GTA 6. But, uh, thank you guys for watching, and, uh, have a great rest of your night.